Yo, what up YouTube, it's Rain the ma 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 mask uh, And you know what this is, this is like a, a, a comparison video um, A comparison of two trainers that I believe are kind of the same-ish uh, When I say the same-ish, I mean like in, in, in the style of the trainer, the height of the trainer Probably the weight of the trainer and, and in regards to fashion, how you can actually wear the trainer Now um, so the first one is the ZX Flux. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna flick the the, the actual um, flash on, so do not worry. Oh, I'll take the massive light. I'm not gonna be doing many more reviews because that's my um, that's my fund. That's my um, trainer fund, and it's very low. Shouts out to Mod on Craft. Um, part of the reason is because of him. <laughs> he knows what I'm talking about. Uh, anyway get back to what I'm doing. Second, Nike Arachi Triple Blacks, which are releasing, apparently, um, I don't know, the 8th or the 7th, or maybe Monday, I don't know. These are unworn, you get me? Brand new, original, the ori no, no, not the original ones, these are from America. But anyway, what was I doing? Yeah, so I was doing the review. So, Triple Black Adidas, Triple Black Nike Harachi. Let me just flick into the um, flash or flick onto the light video, like whatever you want to call it. So, oh. right. Now, these have recently come to um, come to popularity due to somebody wearing them. Um, and it's a shame, like, he's worn them. Now everybody's on them, on them hardcore. But um, let me just kind of review it. So, this midsole is like a, a really basic midsole. I, I don't think... There is any quality in that midsole. It's like a, a really light, light foamy rubber. Um, and if I'm honest, it's an awful foamy rubber. Rubber. Um, and when you step, it will crack easily. Not crack, but you know, crease. You probably can't even make it out there. Um, I actually, I tried these on. Um, and boy, they were just, just uh, awful. Uh, that's what I would say. Awful, awful. Anyway. Um, and if I compare that to the Harachi midsole, I know we were complaining about the quality of these when these released, but there is a, there is a distinct difference in quality between the Nike Air Harachi midsole and the Adidas ZX Flux midsole. Um, yes, it will crease as you step on it, but for me, it's just a lot more sturdy um, and just a lot more. There's a, it's that is more trainer to it. Anyway, moving on. So the back quarter of the trainer or the back half of the trainer is this kind of um leather i want to call it pack leather but it's not it's just like a and it's not even leather it looks like leather it's like a a, a bait plastic um, and i'm sounding kind of unfair towards this trainer aren't i um i think they're supposed to have modeled it off of a snake skin come on focus um but it it, it looks okay like from far away it looks okay like that looks like a decent trainer from far away. You bring it close and you can kind of see that the quality is just not there. Um, and then if I take the Harachi, and obviously you know the, the classic Harachi um, back quarter. Um, it is a lot of quality or good quality. The only thing is everyone that's got Harachis. Now, there's a lot of you that have got Harachis and a lot of you that are watching this video. Please, is there anyone that has Nike Harachis and that this tab, where it says N-I-K-E, does not bud off the back of your foot. Like, bud it off like your foot's been eating pepper. Like, Nando's extra, extra hot. Car, I don't know what to do about that. It just kills me. But anyway, moving on. Toe box. Completely, completely, completely fabric. There's no kind of in structure to it. Just apart from here. You, put, you can't see it, but there is just a little bit of padding here, which you wouldn't be able to tell unless you've actually got the trainer. And I believe that's just obviously to support this part of the toe box. Um, I thought it's quite good. It does hold its shape when you put your foot into it. How long it will hold its shape for, I'm not sure. Um, Harachi, the quality on the Harachi in regards to these Adidas is just leagues above in a different class. Um, again, we have complained about the quality of these Harachis. But personally, personally, like looking at some of the competitors, 
and this and that Adidas is a competitor shoe trainer, it is just a lot better. Um, now, the thing that gets on my nerves or got on my nerves, like I these are sixty six pounds, and sixty six pounds is not a lot of money for a pair of trainers, especially ones which are kind of like fashionable, if that makes sense. Now, you see these lace holes. They're the worst thing ever on one of these on these pairs of trainers. Um, it's probably not this one. It's probably the left one. In a nutshell, um, I got these, put them on, and the lace the lace hole came apart from the trainer, exposing the inside of the actual mesh. Which I just thought, for irrespective if you pay sixty six pound, here it is, sixty six pound or one hundred and ten pound, it shouldn't be happening. Can you just make that out? Look, coming away, and I, I, I'm a person. For me, if <laughs> if what if I pay for a pair of trainers and something goes wrong, I want I, I want a refund. Simple as that. Karachi, you won't get none of that because look, lace holes are actually in the upper. Um, but anyway, a lot of people are going crazy over these Kanye. Or, fuck it, they're not Kanye West. They're ZX Fluxes. Um, and people are trying to make money off them, trying to sell them for £120 and all that. Bollocks! They are worth £60. £66 is a con. If anybody tries to sell you these for more than £66, slap them in the face with a wet fish and say, Rain, the ma -ma 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 mask says you're trying to bump me. And just take them and walk off. You get me? Me personally, if I was to buy a black trainer that's in the hype, it would always be the Harachi. The triple black Harachi coming back out this week. If you haven't, if you haven't got them, get them. Will there be any resale value in there for the resellers? I don't know. I hope not. Who knows? If you ain't got hundred pound and you want something quick and cheap, cheap and cheerful, go to Foot Locker. You can still get these in some of those shops. Oh yeah, and I did ask Torjon Bar. Nothing we need to talk about. Is shit. Rain the mama 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 mask. Signing out. See. Ya.